Is the truss becoming obsolete? Let's find out. <music> 3D printing has made it possible to produce objects with previously unimaginable internal structures. That includes adding internal voids to make objects as light as possible, but it's not easy to figure out how many holes is too many. Fortunately, a research team from ETH Zurich and MIT have developed material architectures that push the theoretical limit of how stiff something with internal voids can be. The key to the design's stiffness comes from the researcher's use of plate lattices rather than truss lattices. Why are plate lattices more robust than truss lattices? Think of it like this. Imagine two cubes with thin outer walls that depend on inner struts for support. One cube uses trusses, the other uses plates, but they have the same material volume. Now think about what happens to each of the cubes when a force is applied to one of their faces. The first cube, only one of the three struts actually carries the force. The other two don't contribute unless force is applied in another direction. In contrast, two of the three struts will always contribute to the second cube's stability, regardless of the direction of force. The applications for plate lattice structures are practically endless. And since they're almost at the theoretical maximum for porous structures, you can expect that they'll be the design of choice for 3D printing lightweight materials. Tell us what you think. Comment below, connect with us on Facebook or Twitter, start a project board, or subscribe here. Here, 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 here. Subscribe here. <laughs>